that uh, physical, hard-nosed win on the road. That's exactly what we needed coming in here. Zero turnovers, two takeaways. Ran the football, stopped the run. We used all 46 on special teams. And now we move on. We'll open it up. Coach, you did remove a couple guys. Like Odell Beckham Jr. didn't play a uh, majority in the second half. At what, at what point of the game did you decide that a majority of your starters were going to play in this game? Or going in the Why did Odell leave in the second half? Coach's decision. How much did John do? Personal fouls on Norman play into it? Zero, that's zero factor. How's Jack? Do so you plan on taking him out at some point again? At some point in time in the game, I was going to take him out of the game, yes. Why not Eli then? I decided to uh, use the coach's decision on Odell. How's Jack Rabbit? Uh, he's sore. Uh, they're looking at him right now. I know he's sore. Uh, we wanted to be smart with him. You said that you, this was exactly what you needed coming in here. What, what did you mean? Just a physical, hard-nosed football game against a hungry team on the road. Uh, where we ran the ball, we stopped the run, we took care of the ball, and we took the ball away. So Josh Norman seemed to be baiting Odell into a couple of, uh, into uh, trying to fight back or anything, but unfortunately for you guys, Odell didn't do anything. What can you say about that? I thought uh, Odell played good football today. It, it wasn't a game that was going to impact where you got a special playoff stand, but what do you feel you came from your team or learned about your team? We played physical, hard-nosed football on the grass, on the road against a hungry football team. We ran the ball. We took care of the ball. That's important this time of year. Ben, you started Paul Perkins, um, and he got over 100 yards. And what can you say about him and moving forward? Is he the number one running back now? We'll go back. We'll take a look at the tape. Uh, we're confident in uh, Paul and Rashad and Bobby Rainey uh, as well. And uh, we'll use our backs accordingly. What do you think of how he did? I thought he ran nice, nicely. I thought he had a couple nice cuts. Uh, stuck his foot in the ground. Uh, he had a chance to put his pads down a couple times and uh, run for some physical tough yards. Um, we'll take a look at the tape. You don't know who you're going to play in the playoffs, but how do you feel about your team going into them now? Uh, like I said from the beginning, I like this football team. Uh, I think we have talented men of integrity in the locker room, and that's where it starts and that's where it ends. Um, good group of guys that's willing to work. They like football, and you saw that today. Ben, did you have any doubt that when you decided that you guys were coming here to play to win the game, that you were going to get the kind of performance that you got from your team today? I think uh, the guys fought their, their tail off out there tonight, and uh, we used all 46. Uh, everybody played a part on special teams, uh, on defense especially, and on offense. And it was encouraging, yes. Was Bobby Hart not playing an injury thing? Bobby, uh, he had the, uh, his arm flare up at the end of the week, and uh, it was a coach's decision to hold him. So a coach's decision meaning because of the arm or or His arm flared separate. up at the end of the week, and it was a coach's decision to hold him. So it's a precautionary measure. You don't think it's going to be a long-term issue? Uh, we'll see. Did you congratulate the team on the, on the regular season, on the fact 11-win regular season? No, I congratulated them on today. What does it mean to you to win 11 games on the regular season? Uh, you know, I thought we came out today. We played physical, hard-nosed football on the grass. That's what we needed to do. We needed to run the ball. We needed to stop the run. Um, you know, we took the ball away. We took care of the ball on offense. That's big for us as, as a football team.